So if toys and empty cardboard boxes are now state-of-the-art for Japanese art, is there still a place for traditional art forms? I hit the streets in search of an answer. As Japan modernises and westernises at such a phenomenal pace with its radio-controlled channel changes, bicycle production and the motor car, it's easy to see how the Japanese have let their traditional arts slide into oblivion. And the ancient art of origami is no exception. In the West, it could be a party trick. To the Japanese, it's a delicate, deft link with the long past. But one man has revived it and sent it rocketing into the future. Say goodbye to the lotus flower, say hello to the paper robot. Tomohiro Yasui began crafting paper robots at age 11, so as not to risk damaging his beloved robot toy collection. 15 years and several hundred paper robots later, Tomohiro's childish hobby has become big business. There's paper robot wrestling, paper robot DVDs and other merchandise marching off the shelves. His paper robots have truly become a new art form, with people building them from kits and collecting them, sometimes even playing with them. I was lucky enough to wrestle Tomohiro into my Tokyo digs to show me his bots. Tell me about the, uh, the Kami robots here. Um, why did you make them? Originally, I really liked TV animation series about robots like Gundam. At that time in Japan, there was a boom in professional wrestling. My vision fused the image of masked wrestlers and the image of Gundam. I like the way they move. They move better than plastic robots. They kind of move more like people, don't they? I wanted to recreate the real movements of professional wrestlers. I thought there was no way a person could rotate its shoulders 360 degrees, so I worked on the structure of the joints to make them as close to that of a human as possible. Do you want a battle now? I can't right now because there are lots of people around, and it's my private world. I've done it with spectators before, but I had my back to the spectators, and the battle was filmed and shown on monitors for them. If I'm watched directly from in front of me, I can't enter the imaginary world. Do you like to ever put on a wrestling mask yourself? Not so much that I like to wear them, but I do really like wrestling masks. I have some wrestling masks. Maybe we should get together one night, just hang out wearing wrestling masks. <laughs> well, if all the great new art we've seen tonight were laid end to end, then dipped in a mixture of raw egg, breadcrumbs, fresh garden herbs, and baked in the oven at gas mark four for about half an hour, what a delicious desecration that would be, but what have we learned? Ancient Japanese knock-knock joke for you. Knock-knock, who's there? Pop-art, pop-art who? Pop-art and buy some noodles, will you love? Oh yeah, someone aside. Good night.